Hello and welcome back to <laughs> another AI tutorial. Actually, this one's gonna be a lot of fun. So what I'm doing is I'm creating the chatbot challenge for all you AI artists out there. I'm really looking forward to seeing your responses to this. So the idea is basically I'm gonna challenge the OpenAI chatbot, Jasper chatbot, and myself to see who can create the better image from scratch. Now, the test is fairly simple. Let me go through the rules. What we're gonna do is I'm gonna create my image first. So let's say I wanna create an image of a cat. I then type in all my prompts for the cat and then I create four images based off of that. Now, what I would do is I would take a question and I would feed that same question to Jasper and OpenAI in order to create the same type of cat photo. So if I say I want a white cat with a black background, I would just tell Jasper, please give me a description of a white cat and a, ba and a black background. And I would say use that same exact question for OpenAI chat. And then I would copy and paste those prompts into uh, mid journey and I would see who creates the best image. So in order to make it fair, there is no re-rolling on the images. What you get on your first attempt is what you get. Adding prompts like photography and no blemishes will be added to the prompt if it's appropriate. So basically if I'm creating a uh, portrait image, which I'm doing here a little bit, I'm going to add the uh, prompt photography and no blemishes to the uh, prompts, whether they come from myself, Jasper, or OpenAI, just so we're all using the same exact medium. I don't want Jasper to create a uh, oil painting and OpenAI to create a sketch. I want everything to be roughly the same style so we can compare apples to apples. Then, in order to... to not uh, put any bias on which images we choose. Of the four images that are returned, you select image number three. And that's the one that you will then uh, upscale for your final comparison shots. Pretty straightforward, all right? So let's get into it and I'll show you what I mean. So here's the first one, an elf in a fantasy market. I told AI chat to uh, the uh, Jasper and OpenAI that I wanted for an AI generator describe a scene where an elf is in a fantasy market. And here are the three images that were returned. What I want you to do is take a quick look at all three images and then think to yourself, which image do you think was made by what? Which one was made by OpenAI? Which one was made by ja uh, Jasper? And which one was made by me? As you can see, they're all fairly similar styles. So it may be a little hard to figure out what it is. By the way, I am going to include all the prompts that I used in the uh, comments below. I was gonna put them in the presentation here, but they were a bit long in some cases. So I'm gonna make a separate post down there. So you can just cut and paste into your favorite uh, AI art form generator, such as Midjourney and you could use them to your heart's content. So, which one do you think was created by who? Got your answers? All right, let's go on to the next one. So, as you can see here, number one was made by Jasper. Number two was made by OpenAI. And number three was made by me. Now I followed the same rules for all three of them. I put in the prompts one time. I added the extra prompts, photography, and no blemishes at the end, just so it was fair across the mediums. And I picked image number three of the set that was brought back for upscaling. Pretty cool, huh? All right, that one was fairly easy. At least I think it was. Let's move on to the second one. So in the second one here, I wanted to do a simple portrait image. Right, so 
for the AI, I asked, for an AI generator, describe a portrait image of a beautiful woman, including lighting and posing. And this is what was returned. We have number one, we have number two, and we have number three. So, once again, which one do you think was made by Jasper? Which one do you think was made by OpenAI? And which one do you think was made by me? Got your picks ready? All right. Pause it if you don't, because this is kind of, this is the fun of this. At least I think it is. All right. Let's figure out, find out who made what. All right. As you can see here, number one was the portrait as described by Jasper. Number two was described by me. And number three was described by OpenAI. I think all of them did a really good good job. I'm actually very impressed with the OpenAI one here, to be honest. But, I mean, they're all a good start. I think the eyes came out way too powerful here in the one that, uh, that I created. And even though I told it was photography, it still came out as a, like a sketch for, uh, for Jasper, which was an interesting take. All right, so on to the final one. I want to do product photography. Now, if you decide to do this challenge yourself, you can make the groups whatever you want to make them. You can make them portraits or fantasy or surreal paintings or oil paintings or whatever it is that comes to your imagination, feel free. This is just the three different groupings that came to my mind when I was putting this together. So for this one, I wanted for an AI art generator, describe an expensive watch for a product photograph. All right. So we have number one, we have number two, and we have number three. Which one do you think was made by AI, OpenAI, by Jasper Chatbot, or by me? Got your picks ready? Okay, if you haven't, be sure to pause. Let's go on to the answers. So, as you can see here, number one was by me, number two was by Jasper, and number three was by OpenAI. Now, I've got to admit, I'm really impressed by how they all did in every scenario. I mean, normally, at least for me, I'm into the prompt crafting. I love putting in all kinds of different prompts and such like that and trying out different things. But I can see by putting, you know, putting in the Jasper and the OpenAI chatbot answers, it's all by description rather than prompts. I mean, yeah, you might want to add some prompts to narrow it down, but we'll get to that in a moment here. So those are the three categories that I picked, uh, and basically a fantasy thing of an elf in a open market. I wanted to pick a uh, typical modern type of portrait, and I wanted to pick some product photography because those are all things that I know and I enjoy. So that's what came to my mind. Gives you a little peek into what's going on in this brain. Any case, um, as you can see, the Jasper and OpenAI provide some really good platforms. If you're like me and you're not very good at describing what you want, entering the basis of what you want into one of the chatbots, and then having them expand upon that, and then you modifying that to your heart's content, but using that as a base to work from, can really provide some really decent results. So as a reminder, uh, all of the prompts that I used, both from AI, from Jasper, and from uh, myself, will be included down in the comments section. Um, of course, I'm doing this before I actually post the video, so it's a very long document. So I might just create a link to it. it depends. Uh, we'll see what YouTube allows me to do. In any case, I hope you enjoyed this video. I know it's a shorter one. Um, hopefully that, <laughs> that is something you guys enjoy. Hopefully you enjoyed this. And as always, I wish you guys a fantastic day. Have a great one.